Hello everybody, it's good to be here. Welcome to day 62 of 90 Days with Jesus. I'm sure you've been having a great time so far and been getting blessed by the daily learnings. So today, on this day 62, we're going to be talking about driven by purpose. Now, we all know what purpose is and I'm sure we've read so many self-help books and we've read the Bible also on what purpose tells us. But what is purpose to you? I need to understand that every single one of us was created with a purpose in mind. And if you believe in a, there being a creator, which is God in this part, and you being the created, then you need to understand that you are definitely created for something. For example, the people who manufactured cars, manufactured the cars to move on the road, or people who manufactured airplanes or shoes or even clothes, they are manufactured for a purpose. So the first thing you have to get, get out of the way is the fact that you are actually created for something. There's no way a whole you, a whole human being, like you will be made and you don't have a purpose. The next thing is understanding that, in understanding that you have a purpose, as a human being, we are created to be fruitful on the earth, we multiply to spread the word, spread the good news. We are created to flourish here on the earth. But then you have a specific purpose. In the case of Jeremiah, when, when God was talking to him, he said, before I formed in your mother's womb, I knew you, I had a plan for you, I had ordained you as a priest. So the question is, what is your specific purpose here on earth? Because I'm sure you know that your purpose isn't just to come have children and die. So the onus is on you to actually go back to your maker and to understand what exactly he intended for you when he sent you to this world. So that you are able to live a life full of purpose, full of victory. And so you are actually driven by the desire to not just live your life and make money and be successful, but be successful in the assignment that you are specifically called out to do. So as Christians, we need to understand this and we need to constantly pour ourselves into that purpose that God reveals to us. So I'm going to challenge you today. Reach out to the King of Kings. Reach out to the one who made you, who knows you, who knows your beginning from the end. And let's try to understand what exactly he has called us to be, what he exactly has called us to do, who he has called us to impact. And this will help us live the best lives that we can possibly live in this world. So I'm going to just pray with you very briefly. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I commit everyone listening to this into your hands. I pray that you would help us walk according to your perfect plan for us, according to your perfect will, according to the purpose for which you created us. That for those of us that know, understand, know, have, or have an understanding of your plan, that we shall be diligent in walking according to the goals you have set for us. And for those of us that have no idea, that you shall begin to reveal to us on a day-by-day -day basis so we may have a better understanding of who we are in you and what we are here to do in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you for being with us today. God bless you.